congratulations on on another season of 911 and you've been a part of this since the inception of this production so you know when you think back on it what do you think it is about the show that just really resonates with people and has made it such a successful show um you know i think some number of things um on one hand it's a show that you know the real message behind it is one of hope um and you know this reminder that there are these these men and women and uh, that will run into the danger if anything happens for you and um you know they when everybody else is running away from it they're running to it and i think that's a lovely thing to you know be reminded of but then on the other hand i think the show itself flicks so kind of effortlessly between tones that kind of whatever mood you're in you can sit down and watch an episode of 911 and 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 take something away from it um so i think people have really embraced us because of that Absolutely. And okay, I got to talk about this British accent that you've got. A lot of people don't know that you're from London. I mean, you're able to change your natural speaking voice when you play your character Buck on the show. You know, it, is that easier now that you're, you know, five seasons in? I mean, is, did you have to take classes? Like, how did, how did that work? Yeah, so it's, it's, not, it's not my first time um, working in an American accent. So by the time I got to this show, I felt pretty comfortable but listen there are still days where like there's a certain word or something that will stick um but it is funny because as you say we're five years into this now and and say the the 911 on fox account will you know post a promo vid or something where i'm speaking like this still to this day people will be like oh my god he's british um but listen I, 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 I love it every single time because i take it as nothing but a compliment um so so yeah every every time it makes me smile Oh, I love it. Okay, so the second half of season five is premiering very, very soon. What can fans, loyal viewers expect to see from the second half? I think it's a really kind of gut-wrenching second half of the season. Um, Like, there are these big uh, spectacle set pieces, but at the same time, like, the characters are really going through it. But I think in a very kind of cathartic way. Um, You know, we've kind of had what is it, four and a half seasons of like trauma and pain being heaped upon them. Um, and I feel like in this back half, there's a real chance for them to talk through those things and and, and deal with them and lighten that load. So, you know, you, you get all the typical 911 action and then you get a lot of kind of heartbreaking and and, and uh, fighting through these things uh, together as, as a unit, as a team. The cast, I mean, it's a bunch of heavy hitters like yourself, one of which, including Angela Bassett. I mean, you know, what's, what's it been like to work, you know, with her? For me coming in in season one, like the whole cast around me, they're, they're such brilliant, experienced actors, but they're also just really lovely people. Um, so, so I've been able to kind of watch them work and, and learn from them in that sense, but then also just watch how they conduct themselves and, and you know, how they behave when the cameras aren't rolling. So it's been a, a really wonderful education for me because they're such open, loving people that it never felt like, oh my goodness, I'm working with Angela Bassett. It just felt like, here's my colleague who has welcomed me in. And, and yeah, so it, it's from the get-go, it's just been a, a really wonderful experience. And before I let you go, I want to, you know, I want to talk about, you know, how, what you enjoy about about nine one one, about your character, and just being a part of this whole series. What makes you so proud, you know, to say that you're you're a leading actor in this series? Well, you know, it's it's if I look back to young Oliver, even really before I had aspirations of being an actor, like this is the kind of stuff that I I, I would have chosen to be doing. You know, like doing the action side of it but then this is a show that really leans on its characters and 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 depends on them in the sense that we're not just an action show because if we were i don't think you would care about the action i think it's a show that understands the balance between the the action and the emotional um punches that it can it can kind of throw so for me to get to be a part of that and and exercise different muscles as an actor like long may it continue